What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to fix the uh, transaction pending error that you get when you purchase a game or a product or DLC over at Steam. So without further ado, let's hive right in. So to actually do this or fix it is quite simple. And this problem is actually uh, tied to either your bank account or your banking statements. And there are a couple of things that you guys can try to actually fix this. Now, the first way is to actually reach out to Steam and appeal for um, a fix or for them to look into your problem while you're unable to purchase a game. So the way it works is um, you'd basically click on help. So that can be found when you have your Steam client open like I do right here. So you click on help, go to Steam support like so. And from here, you guys would want to select uh, games and software. So the way it works is um, if you don't find your games here, because um, recent products is not actually what you're looking for. So let's say that you want to buy a game um, on Steam. So you basically want to type it here. Um, right off the bat, let's do a, a set of Corsa. So it's this one right here. Okay, this is the one that I actually own, but I don't own the older version of it. So what's going to happen is uh, you're going to click on this, set of Corsa. I'm having trouble with my retail CD key or it's not in my library. So you want to select either of these because um, the idea here is we basically want to appeal to Steam to ask them to look into the problem why we can't buy this game. So um, you want to click on contact Steam support or I have a different issue with this product or I should say um, yeah, just contact Steam support and basically uh, provide details about why you can't purchase it. So they're going to look at um, the uh, the <clears throat> the going ons on their end as to why you can't purchase the game. Maybe there's an error with their system or your server or whatnot. And if that doesn't fix it, um, you guys should contact your bank as uh, this may be an issue having to do with um, you making transactions online and your bank um, blocking the aforementioned transactions. So uh, that's one way to do it. And another is to try to use a VPN as um, this will actually lift a couple of restrictions if you're trying to buy a game on Steam. And if all else fails, you guys can actually buy um, Steam cards online, or not online, um, at retail stores, uh, basically stores that sell games. I'm pretty sure uh, most of them uh, more often than not actually have Steam cards for sale. So you basically just input the um, Steam uh, retail key or the um, ID, and then you'd be loaded with Steam points, which you in turn used to buy the game. So those are a couple of ways to fix the issue. So yeah, that's a video. So hopefully it helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So if you guys want to show your support to that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So yeah, um, with all of that said, thank you all for watching. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.